Yo guys, what's up? Today I'm going to be talking about how to network with other producers and collab with them from Instagram. And we're going to go over how to send out loops, how to find producers to work with and how to reach out to them. So if you're having trouble networking and, you know, finding other producers to work with, this video is going to cover all of that. So first of all, you need your loops in a in a folder. So Dropbox is the most efficient way. So just set up a free account. It's super simple. Um, create a folder and then you put all your loops in there you put your loop agreement just in case anything goes bad and your tag and then this is the folder you're gonna be sending out so you should have the Dropbox app on your phone and what I like to do when I'm reaching out to producers is I'll find the best loop in the pack or just my favorite one I'll screen record like the first eight seconds of it and I'll use that as kind of a sample to send to them just so that they know kind of what my style is or what I'm gonna send to them. So I'm gonna start screen recording on my phone. And basically, this is the Dropbox app. You wanna go to Instagram. And then this is how I find producers. So you go to the search bar, you go to Trap Beats. This is the one I like to use the most. And then you go to the hashtag Trap Beats and click on Recent. So. Here you'll have all these producers all look at all these beats there's so many of them so many you know so much untapped poten potential so you can go through so i have a my loop pack is kind of like you know wheezy stuff like pyrex whip -a type stuff kind of that you know dark type ambient loops so i'm gonna find a beat that sounds like that and then i'll get back to you Well, there it is. Okay. So, this producer right here, he has 241 followers. And, you know, that's really not a big deal. We're not going for, you know, producers with big followings. We're just trying to build a network of producers that we genuinely like to work with. And we send out stuff a lot. So, first, you want to follow them, of course. Then you want to go to the, your messages and you want to send the first message. And what you want to say is something along the lines of, Hey, I just heard your most recent beat and I really liked it. Then you can say something like, your drums are really bouncy. I have some loops that I think you could kill. Would you be interested in working? Question mark. And then you wanna say like, Here's a sample of what I have. Then you send that out and then you go and send your, your sample, your screen recording. And then when they respond or if they respond like, sure, what, yeah, uh, you wanna ask, you want, you know, send them through the email or just in the Instagram DMs. And then right here on Dropbox, you're gonna be able to get this link right here. And this is the link to the loops and you're just gonna wanna send them that. And then from there, you know, the ball's in their court, they can use the loops, they might not. And then you just wanna make sure that they're, it's clear that you own 50% of that beat. And you can go back to the hashtag Don't and just find it. more producers, um, reach out to more producers and just do this pretty much as much as you want. So this is kind of what I use to build kind of my network of producers that I send loops to and work with. And if you didn't know this, it's definitely gonna help up your Instagram game. You're also gonna get a lot more followers from this. And it's really just all around a good idea to build your network of producers that you work with. So if I helped you, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, do whatever. And I hope you enjoy it. If you want more videos, let me know. You know, just leave a comment. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.